Hey, what's going on guys? Patrick here. Wanted to do a quick video. Uh, just got my backfire in a couple of days. I've had a chance to put some good miles on it. Had a chance to go up some hills, ride in some neighborhoods, hit some trails. And I wanted to do a very quick video about the top five things that I'm loving about the board right now. Um, just a beautiful looking board. I'm just really excited to have it. Um, the first thing I want to talk about is really the contours of the board. And um, I love the way it's shaped. The, just the shape of the board. It almost looks like something that Batman should be riding around. You know, it just looks so cool and looks so sleek. The board has a different shape than like your traditional long boards. And it's a little narrower in here, so then it kind of bulks out right here. And I just think it looks so awesome, the contours of the actual board itself. So that when you're riding, it just has a very unique look. It looks different. It looks cool. I can't tell you how many people have complimented the board when they see me driving by. So I really just love the contours and the shape of the board. It's a very unique looking board. You don't see too many boards that look exactly like it. So it's a very good looking board. The second thing I wanted to talk about was really just the attention to the detail of when they crafted this particular board. Every single thing that they do about the board is very strategic. You know, one of the things that I always look at when I'm looking at boards is the bottoms, the enclosures. Most of these boards um, that are in a budget range, they're made and shipped from China. And oftentimes they use some of the same parts so from board to board, they don't look very unique. They don't have like a their own thing going on. But the thing I love about this backfire is that like when you look at the housings, everything is, is very particular. It's very specific. It looks very neat and well placed together. Just the attention to the details. When you look at the wheels, um, very clean looking wheels. They have the, the name of the board on it and such like that. Just everything is just very attention to detail. The, the coverings of where the wires are, they have them covered nice and neat. Uh, even the on button when it flashes, it's a, it's a nice kind of a neon bluish light, which is different than some other kind of boards. You know, the, the trucks that they decided to put on there, especially the front one, the caliber trucks. Very beautiful looking board. Just a lot of, uh, one of the things that really was cool was when I bought it and I got it um, in the mail. I, this is my second electric skateboard. My first one when I got it, it was not even paired to the board. So it made me question, did they even test, you know, the control? Did they even test it to make sure it worked? When I got this and I opened it up, turned it on, I didn't have to pair it. It was ready to go, Wheel, wheels were rolling. It was just doing its thing. So attention to the detail, I love that it was paired. It just seems like every single thing that they did, they just uh, mapped it out real good. The remote, um, I'm loving the remote. The, uh, I love the matte finish on it. And then even the matte finish on like the scroll wheel. It just, it just feels like so, um, like a lot of energy and effort went into it. Um, I love the way the control is. I like the way I can put my finger in here as well um, because sometimes I don't like to put this strap on there. Uh, and, and by having your finger being able to put in here, you feel very steady when you're riding the board. I like the controls there and it feels very um, ergonomic. It's a little bit bigger than some of them, but I kind of like that because I have large hands. I don't feel like it's going anywhere. The other thing I like about the board is the turbo mode. Um, I like that you can get that extra kick when you want to speed up just a little bit and, and it cools down after about 30 seconds. So I like being able to accelerate really quickly, get those, if I'm trying to climb a hill or I'm trying to pass somebody really quick, I can use that turbo mode. I thought it was really good. And the final thing, which was probably one of the, the, the things that I enjoyed the most about the board was that it just feels very stable. When they talk about the board, they said that the trucks are a little bit wider than your t uh, typical long boards, but then also the wheels are pretty wide too. And I'm not like a small, uh, a lot of times they test these boards and they say, um, this board will go this many miles, this range, this board will do this. They test them on people that are like 150 pounds, 160 pounds. I'm 230 pounds. So stability is important to me when I'm on my board. And I like the way how it's kind of wide. And then even the contour of the deck and then the wheels being kind of wide as well. It provides like an added stability. Like when I'm going over rocks or anything like that, I don't feel unstable at all. I really enjoy the ride, whether I'm going up hills or bumpy surfaces. So it's just been a pretty cool product so far. And as I continue to put more miles on it, I'll let you know because oftentimes when products come, they're awesome initially, but what does it look like a month, two, three months down the line? So as always, I see at the top because the bottom is too crowded. Wanted to leave you with a very, very quick message, which is don't be afraid to get out of your comfort zone. Um, there's Greatness is waiting on the other side of your comfort zone. Nothing positive and great happens when you just stick in your comfort zone and keep doing the same thing over and over. So keep that in mind. I hope you enjoyed the review of the board. I'll continue to do some more uh, videos on the board as well. Backfire, I think you guys have a winner with this one. I'm feeling it. I'm loving it. I'll do another videos about a couple of things that I think they could have improved.
But as for now, I'm feeling it, y'all. Peace. I'll catch y'all on the other side. Thank you.